Hello and welcome back. It's lovely to see you again. It's been a while I realise, but life kind of just flows and flows and goes and goes and just before I know where I am, like another three weeks have passed since we talked. So I'm in the bath and I thought, oh, a bath conversation. Do you remember Christmas week, the last week of the year and the very start of this year, I had a lot of um, tests to check my bone density and a lot of those tests involved radiation. And so we had consciously here said, oh, in, in about three months, um, it will all come out in my hair and uh, then it'll be time for the hair to go. So this evening I cooked a lovely family meal. We all sat around and ate together and then had a little bit of a rest because obviously I'd been in the kitchen for about an hour and a half and uh, I'd been on the go all day before that. Now I've got a house full because Holly's here, so my son Ivan's girlfriend. Um, so I've got my four sons, two daughters-in-laws, kind of, one daughter-in-law and my son's girlfriend. So I've got a bit of a house full, so we've been doing a lot of stuff together and um, stretching watercolour paper, which is all sort of laid out downstairs. I had to buy a staple gun because the, the heavy duty one we had was um, way too thick, heavy duty. It was going right through the boards, <laughs> so it's not just the paper, it's going right through the boards. So I had to get a, a staple gun. So anyway, I've got watercolour paper, uh, 300 GSM, quite thick, really heavy, really nice quality paper, stretching everywhere. Like around the house. We've got, um, got a lot going on. So this evening, after a little sort of like sit down, my, son's, my son had said, um, Leo, um, um, after you have a have a bit of a sit down after dinner, I'll, I'll do your hair. So I was like, I was like okay. So I went down. So you ready ready for a haircut, yeah? And uh, yeah, the last hour and a half, he's been taking off all the damage. And I have to say, sitting here washing it and just feeling it just feels so vibrant and so amazing and uh yeah i'm gonna rinse all this lava and coconut oil off and uh just conditioning i thought i'd give you a ring but you can see how short it is and uh yeah just cutting off all that all that sort of like bad hormonal mumps the bone density the radiation just getting it all cut off it just feels like <laughs> just everything's like new beginnings the eclipse tomorrow so um new beginnings not tomorrow it's uh, the following day but tomorrow night effectively so yeah so um yeah new beginnings new fresh beginnings and it's going to be amazing and tomorrow we've got um well it's the pokemon community day but i can't bring myself to travel because you we do to get to where the north the, the central london meetup community would be we would have to pass through or underneath at least where the main bulk of the london protesters are and i don't really want to do that because i want everything to stay feeling really lovely and so we, we're going to stay local and um, I was contacted by somebody fairly close by today saying do we fancy doing community day local so it's three hours of uh, catching the same Pokemon tomorrow it'll be Baggin but it's evolution it, evol it evolves into quite a hefty um, character that uh, Harvey loves and so, yeah, so we're going to stay quite local. Um, and then it, either side of that is going to be all inks and paints and artistic stuff. 
um, family. Yeah, it's been it's been amazing. Like doing all this together, it's been absolutely amazing. <laughs> and so, <laughs> and and uh, I I feel so much lighter. That just just the hair was just so heavy, and you know, like I said, you know, all the sort of like bad negative stuff that was present came out of my hair and uh, now it feels like new hair quite literally and the colour is amazing as well so I'm going to rinse this lot off and uh, set this video to upload for some reason they take ages <laughs> so I'm going to do that and then um, yeah it really is lovely to catch up. Um, I will try and get better at doing them. Um, I've been doing a lot of filming uh, for the uh, various things I've been doing. And so that's kind of like, because I'm doing that side of things solo, it's like it's been a, a learning curve because my daughter, who's married and now pregnant with baby Rena, expected later this year, she used to do all the media stuff. Um, and then Ivan, he he kind of took it over a bit, but he's been getting home later and later and later each, well, arriving later and later and later each day. And then you know, no, weekends he's um, playing snooker and uh, all kinds of stuff. So yeah, so I've, I've, I've learned, and I'm doing okay. It was really quite funny. I was teaching the um, group about being fully present in the moment and when my tripod started tilting the other day I, I did laugh because there was a hundred percent of me in that moment where I was really trying to make sure I didn't drop all this expensive equipment like yeah so it was uh, the irony but it really is it's, it's really lovely to talk I know I'm in the bath uh, but you know I'm sitting that's all I can tell you. <laughs> uh, sending all my love to you always. Um, I'm here and uh, if you ever need me, reach out. Love you.